Now, rule three. The use of verb to be in why question. You're going to wonder. We've done this before in rule one. Yeah, but there's a difference. Now, in rule three, we're dealing with verb to be together with preposition. In rule one, verb to be with adjectives. Verb to be with present participle of the main verb. So we know what prepositions are, right? Preposition. Those uh, preposition is basically another part of speech in English grammar that tells us those words that tell us the location or place of something in, on, at, before, under, right? Now let's go into it. You see the W H word Y verb to be noun pronoun and then the preposition in this order. Why is the room in a mess? The Y, the W H word, the is the verb to be. This room, the noun plus its determiner. This is acting as a determiner here, okay? So the noun and then the preposition in. See the second question. Why are you under the bed? The W H word Y, the verb to be are, you, pronoun in this case, and then the preposition under why are you under the bed then you give your reason i'm looking for my kitten why is the room in a mess the children had a pillow fight just now okay now 3b now 3b says the y the wh word y the verb to be noun pronoun base form of the main verb with ing there's also you're also going to see that uh, there is a preposition here, which is what differentiates it from one uh, B, which is verb to be, main verb plus ing, present participle. Okay, the difference between one B and three B is that yeah we have a verb to be and present participle together with preposition. Remember the whole point of rule three is telling you how to use prepositions together with verb to be in why questions so here we have why the wh word why the verb to be is john a noun in this case noun hiding present participle and then our preposition why is john hiding behind the door he wants to frighten emily why were you shouting at the children? See the WH word why. The verb to be were plural past tense. You pronoun in this case. And then present participle of the word of the verb shout. And then preposition at. Why were you shouting at the children? The word playing with matches. Now I want you to Note another very important point here. It says, we use prepositions after the verb to be in why questions. So whenever you're asking a why question with a preposition in it, please make sure the preposition comes after the verb to be. It must come after the verb to be. It may come immediately after the noun following the verb to be as in 3a, or it may come immediately after the present participle form of the main verb as in 3b. Is that clear? Now, if you have